Out of St. Paul, three teens are waking up in jail this morning after they allegedly took part in a shooting and a high speed chase. That chase ended when a Jeep crashed into a St. Paul bar and restaurant. CC's in Lower Town with new information. We're here at Oxcart Ale House, the restaurant that was involved in the crash that you've just mentioned. And as you can see here, the crash left the restaurant in pretty bad shape. I mean, multiple entrances are boarded up. As you can see there, car parts are still scattered. There's glass on the ground. If we go around to the corner here, we can also see that police tape is still up. Now, St. Paul Fire says the building is safe, but the inside will need a lot of fixing. So this is where yesterday's chaos ended, but we wanna show you where it started. St. Paul police officers were called to East St. Paul just before 4.30 p.m. yesterday. There was a report about two vehicles shooting at each other. Officers saw a black Jeep with a broken rear window near Minnehaha Avenue that they believed was one of the vehicles involved. They tried to do a traffic stop, but the Jeep sped away. And that's when the high speed chase started. Police telling us the Jeep reached speeds of 90 miles per hour. Eventually, the Jeep hit a car here at Wall and 6th Streets before slamming into the Oxcart Ale House. Now, police tell us the Jeep in this crash was stolen from St. Paul. Amazingly, though, police say no one was hurt. Jason, Alicia. Cece, thank you. A teenager accused.